What's up everybody, Sean here. Welcome back to the channel. So Bevel just dropped a new product uh, and it is the Ball Bomb. Just wanted to do a quick review, kind of walk you guys through a little bit of the details of it and, and just kind of give you a quick breakdown of, of the product itself. So, so the Ball Bomb is part of Bevel's hair collection. Uh, it's for dedicated for people who you know, are rocking a bald haircut. You know, so if you do the clean shaven look and you want something that moisturizes your scalp, protects it, doesn't give it that over greasy kind of feeling to it. This is a really good product. Now I've been using it for the past couple of days and, and, and one of the things that Bevel calls out is that you can also use it as a face moisturizer. So because of the fact that it has SPF in it, it is a sunscreen as well. I've incorporated into my regimen uh, for the past week uh, and it's it's actually been really really good i'll kind of break down how it works on my skin i obviously don't have an example to show you from a bald perspective for the guys who are rocking the bald look i think this is going to be something that's definitely going to be worth checking out the ball bomb is not super expensive um you know it's only about 15 dollars on bevel's website it's not sold in stores just yet but it will be offered at some point in time but for now you can get it for about 15 dollars on bevel's website so get bevel.com one of the things that this is very focused on is making sure that it protects your scalp. So, you know, for a lot of folks who, you know, do rock the bald look, usually your scalp is, is super sensitive, right? So, you know, if you're out in direct sunlight for long periods of time, it's susceptible to sun damage and other things like that. So to be able to kind of protect it, it's something that has SPF as well as some other ingredients that moisturize and protect, I think this is a super smart move for Bevel. Bevel also has mentioned that this can double as a face moisturizer. So from my perspective, that's how I've been using it. Keep in mind that that might be slightly different on the scalp, but for the most part, it should still be about the same. In general, I think it absorbs super quickly and, and then it also kind of goes on very evenly and then it, it, it has a mattifying effect. So um, one of the things that I've noticed is that, you know, a lot of times when you use other sunscreens, protectors, and even some things for scalps, uh, I've noticed that a lot of folks, you know, who rock the ball look don't really want the extra shine. And this is something that's going to help with that to kind of keep it, you know, more matte looking, not create extra grease or extra sign on, on your scalp. And then if you decide to use this on your face, it's going to do the exact same thing. So typically I, I do this as almost a last step in my regimen. So I'll typically wash my face, tone, moisturize, and then I'll put this on as well right after the moisturizer. And then if I do add some sort of face oil, the face oil will go on after this. And so one of the things that I've noticed is that it does a really good job of mattifying the skin, you know, especially even if you have a little bit of oil that's kind of built up either on your scalp or on your face, this does a really good job of, of kind of evening that out so that it doesn't appear overly greasy. The balm is actually quite thick. And so you get quite a bit in this, this container. This is about the same size as the face wash, beard conditioner, um, things like that. The bottle size is gonna be exactly the same. And you're gonna look for things in here that are key ingredients. Like, you know, obviously there's gonna be the sunscreen, but then there's also gonna be, you know, things like vitamin C, vitamin E and then green tea extract. They're gonna help kind of reduce the appearance of scars. So for those who have maybe made a mistake, when you're shaving your scalp, you have a little bit of discoloration on your face and things like that. As you apply it on a daily basis, it's gonna help kind of fade those dark spots away as well as kind of making the skin look more youthful and vibrant. Um, and so that's gonna be great for folks who rock the bald look. The other part of it is the sunscreen. Um, and so it's making sure that, you know, it's protecting your skin uh, as you go on to the elements. Um, even on cloudy days, even on days where, you know, there's not a whole lot of sun, you're still going to want to have some sort of protection over your face to kind of help make sure that your skin stays youthful and protects it from any sun damage. So especially for folks who have dark spots, I think that's one of the biggest things is to make sure that you have something that protects your skin through sunscreen. So for this, all you're going to take is a very small amount, you know, that, that you're going to add to the palm of your hand. So after you shave, typically in the morning, so if you're gonna head out uh, for the day, this will be a part of your morning routine. And, and for those who are gonna be out in direct sunlight all day for longer periods of time, you just wanna make sure that you apply, reapply this roughly every two hours or so, just to make sure that you kind of maintain the barrier of, of protection. But yeah, this is it, just a really quick breakdown and review, just so you guys can kind of see the texture and some of the ins and outs of this product. So definitely check this out. Um, you know, if you guys have any questions about the Bald Bomb, from Bevel. Make sure you guys leave a couple comments in the section below. If you guys found the video helpful, make sure you guys like and subscribe to the channel. Until the next one, thank you guys for watching. Peace.